The default font for Word 2007 is Calibri, size is 11. The spacing between our lines is set to 1.15. This is different, this is a departure from the older versions, and maybe you like it, maybe you don't. We want to go ahead though for whatever reason and change our defaults, and not just on the document that we're creating, we want it to go ahead and be set so that every single time I create a new document, those defaults are there. Now, the way I like to do it, I think it's really easy, is I'm going to go on my Home tab to the Style section down here and choose this little button, and it's going to show me my Styles window. Now, at the bottom, you'll see three buttons down here. The one I want is the one called Manage Styles. I'm going to go ahead and click on that, and you will see four tabs, Edit, Recommend, Restrict, and Set Defaults. Very important. Make sure that you are on set defaults. Now in here we have a number of options. We have the font and I'm gonna go ahead I'm gonna go old school on us and I will change back to Times New Roman. Font color is fine at automatic. I can change my paragraph position. I don't want to do that. I'm fine with it being left right at the margin. Let's go ahead though and let's change our line spacing to single and I'm gonna leave my paragraph spacing but I'm gonna turn it up to 12 and I'm gonna change my font size to 12 and that looks good that's what I want and if I hit OK here it's only gonna change it for this document the key to this for every new document is click on this button right here new documents based on this template Make sure that's checked. Click OK. And now you'll see it's changed here, but don't take my word for it. Let's go ahead and let's create a new document, a new blank document. See it's still there. Still don't believe me? OK. Let's go ahead. Let's close Word completely. Open it up again. See that? Times New Roman 12. Our line spacing is at 1 and our paragraph spacing. I'll be right back. Finish the first paragraph and when I hit enter it maintained that spacing which I set remember to be 12 points between our paragraphs after the paragraph. Let me go ahead and start another one. And there you have it. And that's how we change our defaults for our new documents. Thanks for watching. For more great Microsoft Office tutorials, subscribe to Train Signal's YouTube channel, Train Signal Office, or you can visit www.trainsignal.com for more information regarding our complete Microsoft Office training library.